Welcome everyone, I'm Jordan Sharp as we head into a Tuesday night of NBA action. We have one elimination game on tonight and a pivotal game five in a tied series as well. Now, uh, lost our bacon a little bit last night, added two losses to the lost column. However, still 27-16-2 and two on the NBA playoffs. We'll head into tonight hoping to uh, get back those two we lost last night. We'll start off in the Eastern Conference here. That's tied series, the Cavaliers. Heading back home to Cleveland tonight to host the Chicago Bulls after two game-winning shots in a row. We knew this series was going to be excellent, and it has lived up to the hype. And tonight, the Bulls come in as a five-and-a-half-point uh, road underdog in this one, total of 191 points. This type of game and this type of total, we expect to see a pretty low-scoring game in this 2-2 uh, in this two -two series here. The Bulls are probably going to bring their defense. They've been playing as good or better on the road this entire season than they have at home anyways. And the Cleveland Cavaliers are, of course, going to bring it, even though they are a little bit banged up. But in what projects to be a lower-scoring game here by the sportsbooks, I think that favors the Chicago Bulls here, especially as five-and-a-half-point underdogs in this one. If the total's low, that usually favors the, favors the underdog in general. However, tonight I think it's even more because in the two games that the under has cashed in this series, in both of those games, the underdog has also cashed in the Chicago Bulls. So the Bulls are also 3-1 and one against the spread so far in this series. So I think that uh, plus 5.5 Chicago, really good chance to bounce back here tonight. They know, they, I'm sure they know that they should have won game number four and should be up three to one right now, but they let the Cavs hang around and ended up giving LeBron, having to fight back and giving LeBron a chance to win the game at the buzzer. Uh, but then again, they probably should have lost game three as well by that narrative. Uh, and uh, Derek Rose bailed them out in that one. But I think the Chicago Bulls here plus five and a half, pretty good play. Add them to your NBA picks tonight. Next one I have for you is the Clippers and the Houston Rockets coming back to Houston tonight with the Clippers up 3-1. to one. And the uh, Clippers come in also as a three-point home favorite in this one with a total of 218.5. Now, we've been, uh, or at least I've been preaching it throughout this series, that the over is definitely going to be the play. And uh, I said it in game one, we cashed it then. I think we've cashed in at least three of the four games here so far this series. Now the total all the way sitting up to 218.5 points in this one. Uh, the highest it's been uh, in the, through, the, through the first five games here. But I still think that the over has a chance to cash uh, with uh, with the Clippers playing on offense the way they have been, even with um, even with Chris Paul still a little hobbled over the last couple of days. You have to think that uh, the, the Clippers are still going to come in and average around what they've been averaging so far through the first four games, which is in fact 120 points per game. So uh, if the Rockets can just muster up a little bit more than what they've been uh, attempting here recently, if James Harden can actually get to the free throw line uh, in this series, I think they have a pretty good chance of cashing the over here in this one. I know the uh, trend so far in elimination games have been leading towards the under. In fact, the under is 8-4-1 and one so far in elimination games during the playoffs. However, three of those unders were the Chicago Bulls and Milwaukee Bucks series, of course, that went up 3-0, to zero, and then they had to play three more games until the Bulls finally beat them in Game 6. Uh, but those three all went under the total, and without those, that, those three games, which was a very, very defensive series, much different than the series we're talking about here in Houston and L.A., uh, if, that, if you take those away, the under's only 5-4-1 in elimination games so far in the playoffs. So I think we're pretty safe here to go with over 218.5. It's a pretty high total, but I think we can get there tonight. Uh, and those are your NBA picks of the day. Best of luck to you on those two. I'll see you back here tomorrow. But until then, I'm Jordan Sharp, and this has been another edition of the Sharp Pick.